Yo, what's going on YouTube, man? It's your boy Prox. We'll be back with some more gameplay, man. Undisputed. Dude does have a reach against me. Joe Kazagi is a very good pick. This dude's only gold one, so I'm not really sure why I'm going against him. But we're going to do what we do, all right? We're going to try to give you guys some clean boxing gameplay today. I do hope you guys have already hit the like button. If you didn't, feel free to do so, man. All right? All right. Let's get to work. We know the rules. We know the rules. We know the rules. We know the rules. Here we go. Okay. I'm using Nigel Bean, by the way. Shout out to everybody in the UK. I just want to fight. And based on how he's playing, you know, he's kind of sitting still, stationary. Not really looking to set nothing up. He's just, like, I mean, look at, look at that. It's really awkward. So just going to touch him up a little bit with the jab. And I have to discipline myself. Um, A lot of times I will go into a match and be like, oh, okay, I'm just throwing a jab. It's not, but I have to understand that I need to throw my jab to look for other punches. I have to make better reads. My jab is just a reader, or my jab is just, you know, just just to give him something, throw something out there. And a lot of guys in the comment section will be like, bro, you're you doing a jab, and all you're doing is a jab. You could, you know, say or something. And but trust me, I get it. But it's something you see that I don't see. You know, it's, it's it kind of plays like that. And I play the way I play. I can't play the way you guys want me to play. Got to play the way I play. And with this guy sitting stationary, this guy is the is opponent that I can open up the opportunity to throw, you know, combinations where I can boom, boom, go to the body. Because he's stationary, you know. A lot of guys that I go against, they're backing up or they're circling out. So it's going to be hard to land the, uh, the combinations on them. I will say one thing that I'm not a fan of is how they how he's standing straight up like this. It looks really awkward. His stance. But I will say to Undisputed's defense, certain things people don't do in real life. Like you guys remember Ryan Garcia when he um when he was fighting I'm about to say Shakur. He was fighting what Devin Haney and he and he did this. He would block, and, oh no, it was his Philly show. He would block and do this, and then he would just turn. Like that looks really awkward. And if they and if that was in the game, Pete, that would be something that I think people would genuinely complain about. It looks really awkward. So really awkward things seem off, and it makes people not like look at it different, like weirdly. Kind of like blocking, you know, blocking the body and moving. No, like in real life, nobody does this. But also. Not many people are going to block the body like this. So it makes sense with the awkwardness, and I, and, I, and I get it. So it's just something, some cleaning up that they would have to do here. So you see he's blocking up top here. So I'm just going to look to attack the body. I can probably fight this dude in the phone booth. I don't know why I'm throwing a cross in the pocket. Nice. That was a power cross. And, so, and a lot of these animations are getting fixed as well, so that's going to help out the game tremendously. His hands are staying high, though. Ooh, nice. Countered on the glove. See right there? Hit him to the body. And you need a lot of pain. Nice. In boxing games, you need a lot of patience. A lot of it. Nice. Nice. Back to the jab, going back to the body. Oh man, this dude is cooked. Nice. I did not want to throw that. I wanted to do this. I wanted to step off, but I hit the wrong analog stick. Oh, check left hook. And like the way he's playing, right? If somebody did this in real life, it would look like it would look awkward. You know, if they did did these evasions, it would look really awkward. If someone was just standing here, it looks extremely awkward. So in the game, it's gonna look that the same exact way. So I get. I get the complaints that people are doing when it comes to this game. 
and I'm not defending it respectfully, but I also look at a different standpoint that no boxer does this. So this is tr this is naturally going to look weird, right? It's 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 going to be hard for them to I would assume fix like like how he's doing this. If someone was in a ring and they was doing that right there, standing in the middle, just doing that exact thing, you would look at them like, well, what the hell are they doing? Right? So it's hard to make awkward things look natural. But again, that, that isn't to me coming to their defense like, oh, no, did, everything's good. No, for sure not. Nice. This dude is throwing that power hook. I mean, that power cross. See if we can catch and shoot. That's something that I do like this game has. It's a catch and shoot mechanic that if you block a strike and then, you know, come back with your own in a timely manner, you actually get a counter for it. Nice. I know a lot of a lot of people are bagging on the game. A lot of people are talking about the game, but I said it in my stream and I'll say it again. I dealt with UFC. I spent with UFC for six years. And about two of those years was on a game that I felt was, you know, actual effort was put into. So... I can I can bear with undisputed, you know, having its problems for, for like for, you know early on within the game, but I do expect you know my expectations will co continue to rise for this game because they are getting more money. They are going to be doing post post release updates, so my expectations are are going to go up. I'm going to expect them to be looking to fix the issues within the game for sure. But again, I, I cut them slack. I cut them a lot of slack because this is their first game, right? This is their first game that they've made from scratch. They don't, they don't, they don't have a built-in stone. This is step one of video games. You know what I mean? Versus UFC, that game's been out, you know, eight years somewhere around there. So th at that point, a game, a game in a series for eight years, you would think, you know, they, they would consistently look, be looking to build. But it doesn't feel that way. So that's why I give Undisputed some slack, man. And a lot of people are giving them, a lot of people are giving them, uh, you know, extreme critics. And again, you are entitled to your own opinion when it comes to critiquing the game. You are not wrong. You are not right if it comes to your own opinions, right? But if we go to the point where we're like, oh, man, Fight Night Champion, you know, people be like, Fight Night Champion footwork looks better than this. I, I, I genuinely want to ask you when's the last time you played Fight Night because Fight Night footwork mechanics are very bad. Oh, that was nice. He's about to get rocked. He's definitely about to get rocked. That's why he backed up. There it goes. I tried to hit him to the... Oh, I did not want to throw it twice. I wanted to hit him to the body because I knew he... Oh, my goodness. Because I knew he was going to only block the body. He's only throwing that power across. But, yeah. Oh, nice. Hopefully, they can, they can, you know, fix these issues. But I definitely think it's going to be hard to make a realistic game. Like, like it's, it's just extremely hard it's just extremely hard to make a a simulation game he was rocking my head boys <laughs> all right sitting at 82 percent stamina so i know he's sitting close to like 60 50 but let me get you guys honest opinion, you know, uh, on the comparisons to Fight Night. I genuinely don't think it, this game is worth comparing to Fight Night because one came out 12, 14 years ago. But the people force my hand when they say certain things, man. When they say certain things about the game, it's like, 
Yeah, his, his head off is low. Like, if we want to go to punch animations, those things can definitely be comparable. Fight Night has their good ones. Fight Night has their bad ones. Undisputed has their good ones. Undisputed has their bad ones. So that that's where I know I, I respect anybody's opinion when it comes to punching. Uh, maybe I should, like, back up. Watch out for that. Nice body work. Nice body work. There it is. I knew eventually we was going to catch him. Nice. Change levels. Went up top. Went down low. All right. First knockdown. This guy, again, he's throwing very wildly, so it's definitely going to be easier for me to catch him and build up damage on this guy. And this is something that I have to get better at myself is building up damage on opponents and, and realizing when, okay, they're hurt, bro. They're hurt. You know, they're hurting. You can, you can, you can stack damage now. You can look to attack. You can look to press. You can look, to look for a possible finish. Like how he's throwing like this. He definitely is hurting to his head. Definitely is. Now I'm hurting to mine. It's time. All right. Also, I'm wondering what are they doing with the adrenaline system? Um, because it doesn't seem that they've said anything about it, and I'm not. I, I really thought adrenaline would be a very, very good mechanic added to the game. It added something new. It added a reason, you know, guys, you know, because because everything isn't just based on that stamina bar. Adrenaline plays, plays a factor, too. You know, you may have an adrenaline dump, which I thought was going to be added to the game. I did not try to throw double hook. I'll let you get unrocked. I didn't try to throw double hook. All right, that one you got to that one you got to pay for because you just stood there. You didn't even look to back up. Defense starts with your feet, you know. Two, Why are you there? I'm not saying run, but you can back up. <laughs> All right. By the way, that's from Fight Night. Shout out Fight Night Champion, man. I mean, not Fight Night Champion. Fight Night Finest. But you just came back from getting knocked down, and you're already throwing. Oh my goodness. my favorite combination right there there it goes nice oh my goodness he just went stiff this is looking like a ggs this is looking like a ggs dude how do y'all get up so much i'm terrible at the mini game y'all get up so much. i wish matter of fact undisputed at and knock down oh my goodness at, so people can literally get better at the mini game without having to. Oh, he's just gonna stand there. So people can get better at the mini game. Let let it be a, a practice course where getting up and let it change with with difficulty. I think that's a pretty damn good idea. A mini game of getting up. The way people can practice, and it can be like level one, level two, level three, level four, level five, so they can practice, practice that. Because there's no practicing it unless you get knocked down. But I don't, I don't really get knocked down a lot because I don't, I don't put myself in a lot of positions to get knocked down. Like, nice. Yep, I know his head up is hurting. So I was retreating right now. Nice. He is throwing that power. Oh my goodness, he just ate that. Yeah, your head off is not looking good, my boy. 
It's nice. Oh, he just got rocked by a jab. When's the last time you rocked somebody with a jab? That's how you know his health was low. I might, did not want to fucking do that. I want to go hook to the body, hook to the head. Like, ouch. Oh, nice. We'll sit in that fire with him a little bit. Possibly get knocked down. Oh, that was good shots right there. Oh, there it is. Why are you? You're on the ropes, man. You're on the ropes, baby. Oh, my. Why are you throwing? You were just hurt. Now! You were just hurt, bro. One, two, three, hey, four. four. And some things like this knockdown seven, system. I. Eight. Bro, how is he getting up so many times, bro? He's used to getting knocked down. He has to be. He has to be. There's no way. There's absolutely no way. Oh, my God. Damn. That's how you feeling? Oh, yeah, he's about to get rocked. Attack the body. I'm looking for that. There it is. Uh, uh, uh. See if we can, we can uh, evade that power cross. Yeah, that's a hard read. There it goes. Ah. You about to get rocked. I'm about to get rocked. Mm. Damn, I wanna I wanna see if I can land it. His stamina is low. Oh, I did the back step cross, and I didn't mean to. All right, let's see if we can pull a counter there. Oh, oh, come on. I think he's in a... Oh, my goodness. Yeah, see... Definitely an issue right there is I'm trying to lean back with the uh, with the weave mechanic where you click the analog stick in, but I may have to try it with the uh, weave while holding the left trigger or L2. It's just it's just weird, definitely weird. Um, those need to flow better. Those definitely need to flow better when you weave back and you follow up with your own strike instead of it being two separate animations and let them blend together. If you guys get what I mean. Like right now, it seems like I pull back and then I, I walk back in and then I throw the straight. But I need to be able to boom. But that makes me back step cross, which I'm not trying to do. This dude's probably nice. Oh, yeah. Yep. It's probably about to be the end for this guy. Nice. I wanted to hit him with power. Let's go loose footwork. I may get knocked down. I said I was going to fight to not be hit and hit, but I'm kind of in the position to kind of do what I want. Yeah. That's a... Uh, Uppercut flash knockdown or actually a flash knockout. I haven't got a flash knockout in so long. It's actually been a very long time since I got a flash knockout. So I'll take it. I'll definitely take it.
All right, GG's. We won every round besides round eight. I mean, we had a 10-6 round. How many t knockdowns did we get? We got six knockdowns. He got up on six knockdowns, bro. I struggle on three. He got up on six. Come on, man. Come on. You are a problem, bro. He's definitely going to be able to, to fight through adversity in the later ons in the fight or once the game releases into the fight because I couldn't get up that many times at all. But... With that being said, man, I appreciate you guys for watching. You enjoyed any parts of the video, man. Hit the like button, subscribe button, turn on notifications. I hope you guys are enjoying the content. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. I can't wait for this release either, bro. I'm telling you, we getting to work.